Looking for the best DDR4 memory for your PC build? Stick around because we're ranking 5 popular kits from worst to first and the results might surprise you. Let's kick things off with the Crucial Pro Memory Kit. It's packing a massive 64GB, which might sound impressive, but when it comes to performance and responsiveness, it lands at the bottom of our list. If you're focused on basic stability and huge capacity, this one's for you, but if you're aiming for speed and snappy game performance, hold up. What's cool here is that it runs at full speed out of the box, no setup needed. That makes it ideal for users who don't want to mess around with BIOS settings. It's also super efficient, sipping power at just 1.2 volts. And the low profile heat spreader means you won't have clearance issues even with beefy CPU coolers. But here's the thing, those loose timings, they slow everything down. Compared to the other kits we're reviewing, this one has the highest latency. That makes it less ideal for gamers or creative pros looking for fast response times. Plus, it's not the best for overclocking, so you're pretty much locked into its stock performance. Bottom line, go for this kit if you need sheer capacity for tasks like virtual machines or memory heavy workloads. But if you're building a performance oriented PC, let's move on to better options. And hey, links to all the products from this video at the best prices we could find are in the description below. Next up we have the Vulcan Z from Team Group. This one's a solid entry level option with a sleek low profile design and a surprisingly strong performance for the price. It's not flashy, but it gets the job done, and that's what makes it such a fan favorite in budget builds. With decent timings and full support for XMP, this RAM gives you stable, reliable performance straight out of the gate. It even has some headroom for overclocking if you pair it with the right motherboard, especially from ASUS. For entry-level gaming or light multitasking, it's a capable little workhorse. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows. You're limited to just 16 gigs here, which might not cut it for more demanding workflows. Plus, not all boards will let you squeeze out its full potential, so you could be leaving performance on the table if you're not careful. If you're building a compact system or upgrading a budget rig, this is a great place to start. It offers good value, especially for first-time builders. And if you've made it this far, hit that like button and subscribe for more honest, no-nonsense hardware reviews like this one. Now, let's talk about the Corsair Vengeance RGB Pro. Visually, this thing's a stunner. It's got vibrant RGB lighting that'll make any build pop. Performance-wise, it holds its own with reliable speeds and respectable latency that puts it right in the sweet spot. Thanks to Corsair's IQ software, you can sync the RGB effects with your system, giving your rig a personalized glow. It also uses a custom PCB and tightly screened chips, which helps with stability and light overclocking. It's great for gamers who want solid visuals and solid performance to match. On the flip side, this kit's tall profile can be a pain. If you're using a bulky air cooler, you might run into clearance issues. And while overclocking beyond 3200 MHz is possible, it starts to hit a wall around 3466 MHz, so it's not the best for enthusiasts chasing extreme numbers. This is a fantastic pick for someone who wants their rig to shine, literally, without sacrificing too much in the way of performance. Just double check your case and cooler compatibility before pulling the trigger. Sliding into the number 2 spot, we've got Corsair's Vengeance LPX series. This memory is like that reliable friend who never lets you down. No frills, no drama, just solid performance where it counts. It's got a generous 32 gig capacity, perfect for multitasking, content creation and gaming. The low profile design makes it one of the most compatible kits on the market. Whether you're rocking a massive air cooler or a small form factor case, it just fits. And with XMP enabled, setup is quick and painless. Now the timings here are a little looser than we'd like to see at this price point. It's not a deal breaker, but if you're looking to squeeze every bit of latency performance out of your memory, it might feel like a small step back compared to our top pick. Still, for most users, especially those balancing gaming, streaming and creative workloads, this kit offers a near perfect mix of performance, compatibility and reliability. It's a crowd pleaser through and through. And finally, our top spot goes to the Ripjaws V by G-Skill. This memory doesn't just perform well, it is the sweet spot in just about every category. Speed, timing, compatibility and value. 
At 32 gigs, it's roomy enough for demanding tasks. But what really stands out is how well it delivers consistent, stable performance right out of the box with XMP enabled. It's no nonsense, no fluff, and totally reliable. Exactly what you want when building a high performance PC. Now, it doesn't have RGB lighting, and it's not the flashiest stick on the market. But when you look at the balance of speed, low latency, and rock solid stability, it more than makes up for the lack of glow. It also has a slight height that avoids clearance issues in most builds. If you want dependable performance with zero drama, this is the kit I'd recommend. It's the best all around DDR4 RAM we tested, and it proves that sometimes classic design and raw performance are all you really need. This wraps up our deep dive into the best DDR4 RAM kits you can get right now. Check out the links in the description to find the top products featured in this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you never miss a future build guide or product showdown.